Okay, brothers, well, put the, put the music down because this guy's going up on YouTube. I don't want them to de-platform. Yes, whatever. the copyrights. We're, 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 we're here unboxing. Well, wait a second. Let me just tell you something. Man. I was surprised. I didn't know it was going to happen. As you may may not know, if you cut me, I bleed audio drama. But, you know, even deeper than that, the vein that you cut is actually a radio vein, right? My theater veins are someplace else. Anyway, they got a radio station here in Philippi. This is a, ra a real legitimate little studio, but it's a radio station. <sighs> wow. Anyway, um, so they're unboxing. Brothers, first of all, brothers, what, 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 what? Yes, sir, what's yes, the, sir, yes, sir. What's the name of the station? Have you named so it yet? this is ZB. ZB? Yeah, the studio manager, and we're at Philippi Village at Black Flips. Oh, Studios. you're, you're ZB. Yes, sir. So you're, 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 you're not ZB, you're ZB. ZB, that's it. How did he get ZB and he's South African? How did that happen? Anyway, so, so, <laughs> just, just thought I'd ask that question. Okay, now, so so that's your name. What's the name of the radio station I'm asking? Black Flip Studios. Black Flip. F Studios. F-L-I-P? Yes. yes, yes. Black Flip Studios. That's it. B-F-S. Okay. I'll go with that one. Okay, now you're unboxing right now. This you, uh, have you started broadcasting already? What's what's what's, what's going on? Just, just 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 tell us some beautiful station. Yeah. So this studio mainly records music, mm -hmm. voiceovers, mm -hmm. um, podcasts as well. We have a mm -hmm. green screen just outside this room. Mm -hmm. um, but unfortunately, we wanted to have our own radio station here, but they told us our space is not convenient for radio. However, we could record um, pre-recorded audio mm -hmm. for radio if we wanted to. Ah, okay. I have an idea. Yeah. As you know, you know what I do. You all know how I they know me enough now. Here we go. Here's what here's what here's what can be done. You know, you can still cable, I mean I'm not you can still because you have that amphitheater outside. You can do live events and just broadcast straight. Mm -hmm. I mean you can bring you, you know you have Facebook broadcasting, right? You have you have uh, 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 Instagram broadcasting. Yeah. You know, people say podcast, forget that podcast business. Is you you Podcast is nothing but radio. <laughs> Let's put yeah. it that way. Yeah, so, so, so they say podcast. It's your, your radio. So, you, or your audio. Or, 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 and, and, that, and that's what you do. Anyway, so you're unboxing. Oh, you got a professional monitor. I used to have a monitor from that brand right there. It's too small for this. Oh, you need a bigger stand. I got yeah. you. So you're just getting stuff together. The sound is wonderful in this room. Wow, man. <laughs> I like it. Um, and what's, what, what, what is this here? What is, what is this here? This, this tower... This speaker, I, I haven't done radio in a while. Yeah. You know, I, I do live stuff now, audio yeah, drama. But this tower is beautiful. It sounds so good when you when when, when you do it. You do have a control show. board, or trans, what we we call a transmission desk. Um, but you you have that. You get you got your double glass window for your studios there, and you get you can you can. Now can these partitions move or anything like that? No, they, they stay on the wall. Okay. Yeah, they stay on the wall. One, 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 time, one time I did an audio drama at, at BAI. In, in, we, was doing, we were doing the Alice stories. And there was, some, there was some things hanging out. And so I had the guys take it. And it was like a, 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 a portable isolation booth. Yeah. You know? So you can, so you can reconfigure the, 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 the studio. You can move it anytime. Exactly. Yeah. Like that. So it's interesting. So what are your plans? Come on, sit over here. Be on camera so people will know what you thought. Wait a second. Let me change this, change this camera like this. So what? So what? What? What other big plans do you have uh, for uh, for for the station? Come on over here. <laughs> I yeah. wish I was the right person to answer. Um, Who is the right person? He just wants the perfect person Zeph? to give answers inside. What's he doing? Here. He's busy. I can give you more answers outside of the hey, hey, hey. Yeah. Make like make like I'm gonna say BC is a big time big time oh, big yeah. time uh, interview or something like yeah. that. Treat so treat me like uh, just, you know whatever. Yes. And we yes. know we want to know about your studio. This boy's still working. We we want to know. <laughs> we. That's what I like you know. <laughs> now, now what, what what let me move my bag here. What 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 now, what 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 plans? I'm gonna let you keep on working that way. Yeah. Now, what what. So is that B? Yes, sir. What 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 are your plans? I guess. Oh wait a second. Are you are you the head honcho? Well, how how did you get this position to be the big the big cheese? What's going on here? Ah uh, man, I'm just fortunate, I guess. Mm -hmm. uh, right place at the right time. Mm 
Uh, but I've also been in the music uh, industry or the production industry for quite a while. I started doing music when I was 14. Mm-hmm. Um, took it seriously at 16. Mm-hmm. Uh, went to varsity, studied audio technology. Ah. Uh, worked at Red Bull Studios for a while. I mm-hmm. spent some time at Rubber Truck Studios mm-hmm. in New York as well. Converse is it Rubber Trucks Converse Studios mm-hmm. in New York. Um, so I'm very passionate about music production, mixing and mastering. But the plans for this mm-hmm. studio mm-hmm. is mainly... Uh, to cater for the local artist. Mm. So we want to give them studio time free of charge as long as they have a plan um, in mm. terms of how they're going to drop the music mm. and then they can prove to us that they also obviously know what to do Mm-mm. when it comes to production. They can you know, mm. control the console, they can navigate some Pro Tools or whatever. Now, do, do you have a training program? In other words, yeah, you're a big time guy, but wh- wh- where's the 13 year old? Where's the 12 year old? You know, yeah. that, 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 you, do you have some sort of mentorship? Whatever. Yes. Program? So the studio is also in partnership with GCAP Studios, um, and they have a DJ course that mm-hmm. they want to get mm-hmm. up and running ASAP. Mm-hmm. We also will be doing one, I mean, sorry, one week short courses in ah, production. Um, one week short courses in mixing and mastering. So we're just mm-hmm. dividing everything into like these one week short courses for mm-hmm. the young guys mm-hmm. to do free of charge as well. Mm-hmm. Um, so yes, workshops, we'll also be doing workshops on a monthly basis, mm-hmm. having in industry role players come and give advice and answer mm-hmm. questions and everything else. No, I, 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 you, don't, you don't know what I do, but when, when I figured you, people are going to ask you a lot of questions, you're going to do a lot of interviews or whatever have you. I never do the regular thing, right? Yes. Sir. Here's my question. <laughs> if these people are doing these free things, free things, free things, you know yeah. what happens when something's free, yeah. people do not appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, I mean, even, even if I had them hustling some bottles and to, to, to pay a little bit or something like that, at least they would have some sort of thing. What, what do you feel about that? They were saying, no, was if you, that's, that's why I said, what do you feel about that? Do you think it should be free? Because you know what happens, especially when NGOs and stuff can come, they just wait for the next NGO come. Oh, I got some food. I got a little bit of money. And they keep on going. The mm. skill is really lost. I mean, yeah. t- just tell me how you figure to codify that, you know, to, to keep it, you yeah. know, to keep it going. And you don't um, lose, you don't lose valuable people. value. Yes, yes. I think, because the thing is with our community where we're in mm. right now in Philippi, um, I mean, it's not a secret, uh, Poverty is real, um, you know, um, so we always try our best, if we can, try to give the skills away free of charge. Okay, it's, no, no, hold on, no, I'm sorry, we're going, we're going, we're going to battle it. <laughs> I love this when people say, well, you know, we're poverty stricken. Oh, really? Do you have a church in the community? Thank you very much. Do you have a Shabin in the community? Thank you very much. If you have a church that can be supported every week, weekly, and you have a Shapin that can be supported every day, then you are not poor. Unless you're eating clay dirt, you know, in the trans sky with no church, no whatever, no school, then you are not poor. Yeah. I just said it. What are you going to, how are you going to challenge me on that one? Well, there's nothing to challenge. I live in this area. I see it with my own eyes. Mm-hmm. I'm here when the shots get fired. I'm here when I see a little kid. Mm-hmm. Um, in the toilet, mm-hmm. left by a young teenage mom. Mm-hmm. So I, I live in this area. I know, you know, I know what I'm talking about. You know, mm-hmm. it's our reality. Of course, mm-hmm. um, shippings are there. You know, of course, GPV is there where you have, you know, males who abuse alcohol, get back home, abuse the mother. You know, it's our reality. Mm-hmm. But we have these kids that are talented, mm-hmm. that have, uh, you know, something to give, but they don't have the opportunity mm-hmm. in our areas. You know, mm-hmm. if you if if you want to go to, the first time I ever went to a studio was in uh, town, Bray Street. You know, I had to use yeah. like 40 rand a day yes. just to be there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But if there's a studio next door, you could just walk. You know, I mean, mm-hmm. it's, 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 it's a big thing. Yeah. However, when I say that, you know, the exchange in this is also they have to give us something back as well. So mm. we give you the studio, but what's your plan after you record your song? Mm. Are you publishing your song? Um, are you dropping it just on SoundCloud? Mm. Are you registered with Samro? And that's where the workshops come in, where we mm. uplift them and give them the skills mm. to be you know, mm. a full product. Yeah. Well, at least you have a space that means that people internationally can come and visit you, whatever have you, with yeah. your contacts when, when you have your studios you know, like that. So, okay, listen, I don't want to keep you because I see you busy. Yes. <laughs> you unboxing. Yes, now, sir. Now, who, uh, let me put it this way. Would the, would the, uh, did you ask for this equipment? Did you know what you was asking for? Did somebody advise you how did this come, uh, yeah. still come about? Yes. So, um, Philippi Village got funding 
Mm. Um, I will show you where. <laughs> I really will show you where. Mm. Um, but the uh, contracted GCAP. Mm. And GCAP is always... Oh, what's GCAP? Yeah, so GCAP is a... What does it stand for? G- I have no idea. Oh. I have no idea. But it's a production company that builds studios. They also do live events. Mm. And uh, it's owned by a gentleman called DJ Ready D. Mm-hmm. Very well known in South Africa. Legendary. Mm. One of the first people that actually started hip-hop in South Africa. Mm. Uh, okay. Just... Um, before uh, 94, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, before South Africa became democratic democratic mm-hmm. and everything else. Mm-hmm. Um, they were very famous for, you know, making all these songs about, you know, the TRC and challenging, mm-hmm. you know. Uh, do, please don't. don't just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just, <laughs> uh, it's just TRC. But, you know, the, the state, 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 state. You don't want to go there. <laughs> Be saying, oh yeah, just like TRC. And I look at them like, oh, you idiots. Yeah, you have no yeah. idea what you're talking about. Yeah. But, but, but I understand. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, I did yeah. not you, of course. But so, um, yeah, so they, they, they in partnership with, with, with us. So they built the studio. They advised on what equipment to use. Uh, yeah, man. So this is all them. This is this equipment. They advised everything, even the, the studio build. You know, how big the studio is, how it should be treated. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's all them. Um, mm-hmm. And I came in in the latter stages when all that was done mm-hmm. and uh, the equipment was bought and mm-hmm. everything else. And then that's when I came in. But they entrust you to, to do the right, right yes. thing. Yeah. Uh-huh. So they trust me to, to set up all the equipment. Mm-hmm. Um, there's obviously a few things that I won't do myself with setting up the digital mm-hmm. console. Mm-hmm. We'll need uh, some pro guys to do that, to attach that to the patch base. But mm-hmm. everything else besides that, facilitating the space, that's mm-hmm. me. Uh, making sure that these workshops get done, mm-hmm. identifying artists in the community that really need the space. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, and that's me. Mm-hmm. But we also do in on the Friday sessions every mm-hmm. Friday at Philippi Village. Mm-hmm. Another space where it's free entry. Um, anyone can perform mm-hmm. as long as you have your music on your flash drive, and mm-hmm. we have a mic. Or you want to dance, you can dance as well. Mm-hmm. The space is there. Because what we found is, as because I'm an artist myself, as well as LSP and Mr. H, who we spoke to now recently, um, we found that, you know, there's a lot of artists in our space, but there's no um, spaces or platform to showcase the art. Mm. You know, we have a lot of dance instructors that take like 40 kids, teaching them how to dance, you mm. know, taking them away from the streets, but they have nowhere to showcase their art. Yeah. You know? Um, so we've kind of built an audience here. We built a community mm-hmm. where these guys from your six year old to your twenty five year old, thirty year old come to these sessions every Friday religiously mm-hmm. and they feel like they're part of something and you know they they, they feel proud to be mm-hmm. a part of England as this small community and they come here every Friday and they you know, they do their thing. Um, no alcohol is allowed because we want to create also mm-hmm. a safe social yeah. space yeah. for the young ones. Well, if you want alcohol, go to Shabin. Exactly. If you exactly. need if you need church, then go to church. Exactly. This is this is a sacred place too. Exactly. The radio studios are very sacred. Yeah. You know, we have we have rules. You know, you can't come in here cursing, you know, yeah. you can't there's a bunch of rules we got. Okay. Yeah. All right, all right. So we also want to thank Philippi Village for that because they gave us the space mm-hmm. and now they're currently supporting us where they can also with sound. Mm-hmm. Um very grateful to Engage your Wi Fi as well who helped mm-hmm. us with giving away free vouchers, mm-hmm. you know, to our attendees. Mm-hmm. And, you know, it's important because uh, Wi-Fi, you know, is access to information. Mm-hmm. Uh, unfortunately, again, uh, there's no infrastructure in our communities. Mm-hmm. So, you know, a young kid can't go to YouTube and be like, how to, how do you make a beat? Um, yeah. How do you start an email? You know, so we're grateful for EKJ for partnering mm-hmm. with us, you know, and helping us give out, you know, these. I got to talk to yeah. somebody, man. You all need to be an experimental help for a thing called Li-Fi. Li-Fi you know, Wi-Fi is radio waves. Yes. Li-Fi is light waves. Okay. Infinitely faster. Oh, wow. It does exist. Oh, wow. You know, there's some. I think that uh, not, not Angola. Somebody like somebody, some other places. They they they've been experiment. India, someplace they have been experimenting with it. There's a company. It's been, I, I've known this since 2011. Yeah. But it's called Life L I hyphen F I. Just look it up on the thing and see what that is, and you'll be properly blown. That way you can go to these funders and say, look, hey, we want to be an experimental home for this Li Fi thing for, yes, for Felipe yes. and see what happens. And believe me, it will change everything for you. So, wow. listen, let me go because, like I said, I can talk to you forever. I have to do. This. <laughs> and I, I'm, I was enjoying this, man. It's like, let's keep going. Uh, I want more uh, questions. Uh, <laughs> uh, all, all I have is, yeah, hey, oh, excuse me, where, where, where's, where's the fire extinguisher? That is a good question. That is a good question. We do have one just outside the studio, but not in the studio. We do have one just, just here by the. Just, the I'm sorry, just. 
you know, my, my brain, remember I'm a trained stage yes, manager, so my yes, brain yes, thinks yes, a little yes, bit yes. different than, than, you know, your regular <laughs> ordinary whatever it is. <laughs> but it's on the way. We still have time. Mm-hmm. We haven't we haven't started anything, mm-hmm. so we could make that happen. Mm-hmm. You know, maybe I don't know it's coming. Maybe Let me ask you one, one, one more, one more yeah. uh, question, uh, question, ZB. Yes, sir. You know, people always ask what you're going to do, what you're going to do, what, 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 what you're going to do next. Mm-hmm. I don't want to ask what you're going to do next. Yes. But, you know, for me, preparation is one thing, but yeah. maintenance is everything. Yes, sir. Especially in space like radius, you know, because something's going to happen. The foam will start de- degrading. Oh, yes. You know, wh- whatever is whatever's going on, you it know, is. tell me that plan. Tell, tell me your maintenance plan. Tell me how you're going to keep the upkeep, uh, blah, 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 blah. You know? Yeah. So that's a very good question, by the way. Um, so yeah, oh, I, th- I never thought of that. <laughs> the, the reason why I say that, if somebody comes here, they, they'll just go. Yes. They, 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 they just had their little pop. They come yeah. Oh, a kid, you know. No, no, oh yes. Okay. Yes yes, like, yes. 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 Hey, yes. 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 Yes what to do, what not to do in studio. Um, but that also that's also where I come in to make sure and facilitate the space because I won't be an engineering, even though I can. Mm-hmm. But the, the deal is to, okay, you need studio time, come through with your own engineer. If you can engineer mm-hmm. for yourself, dope. Mm-hmm. And then I just facilitate, okay, man, these are your channels, those are your inputs, so that all you have to do is just navigate the DAW. You mm-hmm. know, you don't have to fiddle with the equipment and everything else. Mm-hmm. And also with that, we check the equipment before you use it. We check the equipment just after your session as well to mm-hmm. check if everything is in place. Okay. One final question. I I get, I, 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 I lie all the time. But um, I, <laughs> this is the last, last, last question. Let's right? go. Let's go. How, how are you multiplying yourself? In other words, you have tremendous responsibility. Yeah. You are you. They ever can be looking to you because everybody wants a leader, you know? Yeah, yeah. Who, who, Where's the thirteen year old? You know, where's the eight? eight you know, is there sort of something in place? Uh, um, I'm just asking. You know, how, mm-hmm, how, mm-hmm. How, how, how are you? You know, you know, same question. Yeah, no, no, I get it. Totally get it. Um, so what we're doing is we have a team of ten young mm-hmm. journalists, mobile journalists, mm-hmm. who also will be used also to facilitate to facilitate the space. Mm-hmm. PV has plans of building a media center just above the studio. Oh. Yes, with small podcast rooms, and mm-hmm. we also have plans of um, doing the the, the, the radio, mm-hmm. the radio studio up there because it has more mm-hmm. space than downstairs. Um, but also with that is giving these young guys these skills, mm-hmm. you know, um, shadowing me, um, uh, facilitating okay. the space okay. when I'm not yeah. here. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, getting these skills so that when I leave in a year or two, because I don't plan to be here forever, you know, mm-hmm. um, I just want to make sure this the space is piloted because we also have hopes of starting another studio in Mowbray as well. Yeah. Um, with Bertha House. I like Mowbray. Yes, with Bertha House. Mowbray! So. <laughs> Weinberg! Oh, sorry. I'm, sorry. Yeah. I'm, sorry. I'm, I'm getting this Cape Town spirit. Sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. You know, um, so yeah, it's, it's really exciting, man. It's really mm-hmm. exciting. And we're going to do big things. I'm mm-hmm. really excited mostly excited for for mm-hmm. for the youth mm-hmm. of this community mm-hmm. because just with the shows man you see the change mm-hmm. these guys take pride to come mm-hmm. here dressed up you know because mm-hmm. i think the biggest issue sir um anthony if, if if i may add stress again is that the youth because the issue with the high violence and crime and whatever is that the youth doesn't have safe social spaces that's mm-hmm. all it is mm-hmm. You know, there's no safe social spaces. Mm-hmm. They don't have, they don't take pride in, in their soccer fields because their soccer mm-hmm. fields are not maintained. Yeah. You know, that's where the gangsters smoke. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's so there's nothing they can take pride yes. in. But mm-hmm. if we could build a space yes. with art, with dance, music, um, social clubs, where these guys come in, it's, 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 it's clean, it's maintained, no alcohol is allowed in mm-hmm. the space. They can come in, do their things safely within their own communities. They don't have to go to town. They don't have to go far. The library is just here as well. Yeah, you know? nice library. Oh, I was yes. impressed. You so know. Philippi Village is really working hard on that to make sure that we create a really safe space for the young. Mm-hmm. You know, because that I mean, I I got into music when I entered this other uh, youth program as well, mm-hmm. and when I was there, man. I just felt safe because mm-hmm. no one was smoking, but we were still partying. It felt like I was in the club, mm-hmm. but I had no fear of someone is going to stab me as soon mm-hmm. as I leave the door, you know? Mm-hmm. So 
Yeah. Yeah. All right, man. Thank, thank you for this time. I really appreciate thank it, you, man. Sir. Thank bunch, you, sir. Wonderful, man. So beautiful. <laughs> I'm really, I'm serious. I'm serious. I really, yeah. I've been on the planet a little bit. And I, sometimes I, and I travel a lot. And some places I go, I go like, wow, this is interesting. But this, and I know Felipe is like yeah. extraordinary. Thank you so much. I appreciate thank you. it. All right, man. Wow. That was really nice.